Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Kagam. Today, we are going to talk about all of the new beauties that are coming from Your Girl Honey, Big LV. Louis Vuitton has a lot of new releases. I just want to focus on a few things which I think you should know about. Let's get started with this beauty right here. This is a new red Cousin. The color is called Coquelicot Red. I showed it in my Louis Vuitton colors video. I think this is super cute. It has like um, pink and beige inserts as well inside. I think this is really, really cute, really adorable. This is 3,700 euros. I love the colorway. I think it's super cute. There's also this one here, which again, I showed in my colors video. And this one is, I think it's just called like creme and it's like a vanilla color. I'm very curious about like whether these will be popular they're like they, they they have these like classic colors and then they have like some inserts like they have some color inserts like on the monogram as well so i'll be super curious to know if you guys like these they're these new um, bags that are coming out in two contrasting colors there's this micro vanity which will be 1900 us dollars it's very small it does not fit your phone um, from what i was told this will not fit your phone it's a beautiful color this is the kind of color that i would love to wear like in terms of like lipstick and things like that and then there's this speedy here i think this is a speedy um in this kind of i don't know kind of it's like a kind of like a swimming pool blue i'd love to know what you guys think about these ones i mean i think lv as usual is always trolling like she's a professional troll she trolls us and just refuses to stop trolling there's some new exotics as well but i featured those on my previous um colors video so you can go check that out just go on the Louis Vuitton playlist and you can find it there as well let's go back to this micro fantasy this is $1,900 it's going to be launched on the 14th of April I think this is a lot of money um, for something which essentially does not fit your phone um, I'd be really curious to know what does fit but I'm pretty sure your phone also does not fit another new beauty that is on the way in this beautiful blue color is this um, like card holder it's called the lv charms card holder it's going to be 445 dollars and it will be coming out on the 14th of um, april as well the color is really beautiful you know i don't like blue i don't really care for blue but i do think that the color is absolutely gorgeous so i just wanted to show you this one as well okay. the next piece that i want to show you that is new um is this Neo Noe BB. It's going to be $1,900. It's the same price <laughs> as the Micro uh, Vanity. That is completely insane. This is super cute. Um, it's the BB size um, and this is new. This is going to be coming out on the 28th, um, of, um, on the 28th of April. Um, so that is adorable. Now, this is something which is coming, which a lot of people have been chatting about, saying it's really overpriced. Um, and i think it's so cool however i wish they would have made a few little changes it is this um new vase that is coming out and it is called the can vase it's going to be eleven thousand four hundred dollars it's coming out in may on the 19th of may um it's really gorgeous it's really beautiful um and basically it's it has oh, i mean i think that this is wonderful and stunning but essentially it's the can vase you know like the can bag so they've made like a vase out of it with the with the monogram of course the beautiful chocolatey monogram that we all love and then they have this clear um like the, the like they have like another vase that is clear with the monogram symbols all over it as well so you can see the flower stems this is gorgeous i mean i don't know about eleven thousand dollars boo boo but i do think it's super cute i know this thing is going to sell out people are going to buy it and will be absolutely obsessed so i just had to show you um this one as well there's also this Clooney mini coming out i mean the, the Clooney honey she's still around she's still got a wig on this is like one of those bags that i just thought was gonna flop penny and people would not care for this bag um would not want to see this bag moving forward yet this bag continues to be made um so clearly people do like it just because maybe it's not my cup of tea doesn't mean that it doesn't have um its people i want to show you these um new bags that are coming out these are going to be coming out for autumn winter um 2023 these have a very like travel vibe to them you know when you think of traveling 
I would think of something like these bags. Um, I think they are a huge statement. Um, I think that they're so unapologetically Louis Vuitton. Like this is a true Louis Vuitton statement bag. Um, bags, uh, should I say, because there are many of them that will be coming in this print. They're not going to be for everyone, but I think they're wonderful and I think that many clients will like them as well. Just a quick preview of some of the things which you can expect to see from Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton has a lot of new um, releases that are always um, coming out. Um, I hope that I'll be covering as much of their new arrivals as possible. If I think they're things that you'll like, I will absolutely um, cover them. Now, I want to show you um, things which are not new, but they're in store so that we can just quickly talk about them. The Kusama drop two, I think, is better than the first drop. It's a little bit more subdued. It's a little bit more folksy um, and I think it's more wearable, like they can be worn easier. I love this one right here. This motif I think is wonderful and I think people will really like this one. Um, I think this is the on the go, I love this. I think this is beautiful and it's workable. It's a black and pink motif with the pumpkin. I'd love to know what you think about this one. I love the flower capucines. I think these, this is just a very special piece. Um, I think a lot of people don't understand this bag and I think it is wonderful and beautiful and I really like it. It's very expensive, but I think it's a very special piece. I think a lot of, of work has gone into making it look very intricate. Again, not everyone's cup of tea. I think it looks really good in the black colorway and also um, in this colorway as well. The final thing that I wanted to show you that I thought you'd like, um, again, not new, but is some of their fine jewelry. Um, after buying this little ear cuff from Maria Black, which is 18 karat gold plated, um, recycled sterling silver. Um, I'm really obsessed with fine jewelry at the moment. Like I'd love to get more fine jewelry. I'm definitely going to get more fine jewelry from the Maria uh, Black brand, but I love Louis Vuitton's fine jewelry as well. So I just want to quickly show you this video showcasing these rings um, that have diamonds in them and also um, these like bracelets. They're kind of like double bracelets. I think they're super cute, very beautiful, and they look really good. I think Louis Vuitton's gold fine jewelry looks really good as well. For those of you in South Africa, I quickly checked the website to see what kind of fine jewelry the Johannesburg and Cape Town boutiques tend to get. They tend to get the gold fine jewelry in yellow gold a lot, so they'll have just like the classic pieces for anyone who is interested. I'd love to know what you guys think about all of the new arrivals that are coming from Louis Vuitton. What are your thoughts about Louis Vuitton at the moment and what Big LV is up to? Um, and are you guys going to be getting any pieces? Um, not really looking for anything specifically at the moment. I like to keep things at Louis Vuitton nice and fluid. So when I go into the store, if there's something that I like, obviously with the exception of the Dauphine bag, but if there's something that I like, I can just pick it up. However, I do love this, which is this beauty right here. And it is this coin purse. I think it is so cute. It is from the second drop of the Kusama collection. I really, really like this. I need to see it in person to see whether I like it as much as I think I do. But um, the next time I travel, I'm definitely going to try and find this. And if I like the way it looks in real life, I'll definitely get it. I need a coin purse anyway, like a small one because my long wallet doesn't fit in the new Longchamp bag um, that I purchased from Longchamp in Berlin. So that is one of the pieces that I like that I'm currently stalking. I, I just keep looking at it um, whenever I open the app, but again, need to see it in real life to see if I like it that much. I'd love to know if there's anything you guys are getting. Right now, honestly, you guys, I'm really obsessed with fine jewelry. Like my heart is with fine jewelry. I also love this single earring from Louis Vuitton. This is a single earring that I've been thinking of getting and stacking it um, with my um, Maria Black ear cuff that I got. If you saw my Louisa Vyrem unboxing, these are the, um, what's it called? The Louisa earrings that I bought in Paris that I'm absolutely obsessed with as well. Um, so I would love to know like how you guys are approaching jewelry this year. By the way, I love costume jewelry just to be clear. Um, I still love costume jewelry and I think costume jewelry is worth the money because I think costume jewelry is about a vibe and a mood. I don't think everything has to just be about the fact that it's like, you know, gold or silver or yellow gold or whatever. Um, but I do think costume jewelry is fun. Like I still love these. Honestly, I would recommend the um, 
costume jewelry from Louis Vuitton and there there are lots of costume jewelry pieces that I love from Louis Vuitton and I would happily get them I know lots of people are like ah it's costume jewelry you're wasting money but I think it's wonderful and fine love to know if there's anything else that you guys are interested in also super quickly something from men's which I think is really nice for the men who watch this channel is this classic t-shirt um I was looking at this thinking about getting this for my husband as well um and yeah i saw this on the app and i was like oh this looks nice like a nice simple classic t-shirt i know people are going to be like it's overpriced it's just like you know a logo t-shirt i don't care um i think it's a nice cute um piece it looks very classic and simple and it can be worn with many things for men um and there's no question of course it looks amazing on your profile as well i know a lot of people act like they don't care about that stuff but i think a lot of people do care they just don't want to say it so i don't mind being the one um who says it what are you guys getting from Louis Vuitton at the moment? Please make sure you, you let me know. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. Hit notifications, join the Facebook group below. Um, if you love Louis Vuitton, honestly, I love Louis Vuitton. I have lots more Louis Vuitton themed videos coming. Um, and I have a lot of Louis Vuitton content coming once I go to Europe. I hope to go to the LV in Johannesburg in a few weeks time. because so I'd like to pick up a few small things as well. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you very soon in my next video.